Yo, 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 what is good my ugly homies? Welcome back to the channel. I hope you guys are having a very good day today. Thank you guys so much for tuning in to yet another video. Today, I wanted to hop on camera and discuss how to cop these beautiful, these magnificent, these instant classic Supreme Milan box logo t-shirts. If you guys have not been aware, or maybe you just simply haven't been keeping up, I can't really blame you guys. Supreme has been all over the place and uh, pretty mediocre to say the least. Um, I can't really blame you guys once again, but if you guys have not heard, we are getting a new store opening, or actually we already got a new store opening for uh, you know, a Supreme store, that being in Milan in Italy. That as always came along with an inaugural box logo. And let me tell you guys, let me be the first to say, that design, bro, just take take a look at it, bro. Take a look at this right here. That design right here is a winner, man. That is a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful t-shirt. And I'm not sure if the back design, I really haven't been, uh, I guess, uh, you know, looking around to see how the, uh, you know, the actual design is. But as far as the front, beautiful. If there's anything on the back, I'm pretty sure it's not, uh, you know, going to kill the t-shirt. So definitely always, uh, you know, good to see as well. But uh, we gotta discuss how to cop these, man. Out here in the US, I know a lot of you guys are out here looking to cop one of these. You guys probably don't wanna pay resale, like myself. I definitely do not wanna pay upwards of five, six hundred, seven hundred dollars. I can't blame you guys, so let's go ahead and discuss how to cop one of these bad boys. In this video, I'm gonna try my best to give you guys all the details that I know about the uh, about this box logo. Um, this is not public information by any means, so take this with a grain of salt. I will say as well, as a quick disclaimer, I get all of my information from pretty credible sources, sources that I definitely trust. I for sure would not feel comfortable giving you guys this information if I didn't think it was believable. So again, take it with a grain of salt if you guys want to, but for the most part, I definitely think there's a lot of uh, validity to uh, you know the information I'm about to share with you guys. But let's get into it, man. Let's start off with when this box logo officially released. It officially released on the 6th of May. That was this past Thursday, exclusive to the Milan location. With that being said, of course, it was virtually impossible or actually impossible for anybody from the US unless you were in Milan at the time of release to get your hands on one of these box logos. Um, of course, there's uh, you know always rumors when it comes to Supreme. In fact, this morning at 11 a.m., a lot of people were uh, you know talking about a possible release. I know myself, I was prepared. I'm actually still running in the odd chance that there is going to be a shock drop. Um, there's rumors being thrown left and right, as always, <laughs> you know, with Supreme about when this box logo is going to drop online. Um, for what I believe, and let me start off with, I'm 95, actually I'll even up it, I'm like 99% sure we are going to get a release online. From what I've been told, there's about 30 to 35,000 of these box logos sitting at the New Jersey warehouse, which is where Supreme's uh, you know shipping location is. Um, of course, those wouldn't be there if we're not going to get an online release. The big question, the million dollar question is when is that release going to happen? I personally feel like the release is going to happen either on Monday or on Friday. I'm not really leaning more heavily towards one or the other. I say Monday because Monday is usually the day where we get the new store opening box logos released online. For example, the Brooklyn box logo, the San Francisco box logo, both dropped on Monday at 11 o'clock. That being the Monday after the uh, you know the store opening, which would have been today for uh, you know the Milan location. Really odd that they didn't drop, but uh, it is what it is. I say Friday because Friday for the past season we've been getting Air Force One restocks. I'm not sure if Supreme is now you know coining Friday as being like the shock drop day. Um, I wouldn't be surprised if that's the case. In fact, I kind of like it because uh, you know you kind of. Uh, I guess it's not only Supreme on Thursdays. Thursdays is already a bit hectic sometimes for Supreme. Um, it being on Friday, it kind of gives us like a two day, uh, I guess, cooking day for Supreme. Um, I like Friday. I'm going to be prepared for Friday. I would advise you guys to do the same. If you're in a cook group, shameless plug here. If you're in a cook group, if you're in my cook group, definitely be ready. Be you know attentive to that Supreme monitor. Um, I would not be surprised if it's Monday. I would not be surprised if it's Friday. I would just really hate for you guys to miss out. If you do want to be ahead of the game, what I'm doing, and I'll definitely advise you guys to do the same, is just run 24-7. Don't overdo it though. Don't be out here running 50, 60 tasks. 
you'll probably get clipped for being a dumbass. Me personally, I'm running about four or five tasks at relatively high delays as well, around like 10,000. Supreme normally doesn't flag IPs. I would find it really unlikely that they're going to flag you, uh, you know, for running at high delays for, you know, an extended period of time. It doesn't really matter. Again, I'm expecting this to drop sometime on a Monday or on a Friday. I know that there's been speculation of it dropping later in the season. I find that really unlikely for a few reasons. One, we are supposed to be getting the Calls Box logo t-shirt to match the hoodie that dropped in the beginning of the season. I would find it really hard to believe that Supreme is going to drop both box logos around the same time. And also the rumor of the Emilio Pucci box logo as well. That I personally believe is going to drop at a later season. But if it does end up dropping this season, three box logos around the end of the season just doesn't seem likely to me. So I think personally this is going to drop any day now. I hope it doesn't shock drop. I hope a lot of us are ready and uh, you know ready to go to cop it. Um, if it does though, of course, like I said, just run 24-7, keep your delays high. Hopefully, uh, you know, you end up copying with a W. And I know a lot of you guys are at school or at work during drop time. This is, uh, you know, probably the best way to, uh, I guess, counter you missing out on the drop. Um, now, let's talk about resale real quick because uh, I know a lot of you guys are wondering how much these are going to be going for. And I know a lot of you guys are probably contemplating going ahead and picking one up right now. I would say for those of you guys who want to break bank and cop these at the prices that are now, pump your brakes a little bit um it being a uh, you know a fire box logo i can kind of understand your impatience to want to grab one but if this does end up dropping online which is very 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 likely prices are going to drop a lot um if you guys want to compare it to like the brooklyn box logo or the san francisco box logo how even the covid box logo the prices are definitely going to drop pretty heavily. Of course, if you guys have the money to blow and you want to snipe at it, just get it out the way. Go ahead, spend your money how you want. But for those of you guys who want it and you don't want to, you know, break bank for it, just hold off a little bit. 30,000, 35,000. Hell, if there's more coming in, maybe it got delayed today because there's a bigger shipment coming in. If that is the case, this is going to drop a significant amount. I think the uh, you know the the final price where it's going to kind of settle at is around four hundred, five hundred dollars. Um, a perfect example is the COVID box logo. This was a far more limited release than any other box logo we've ever gotten. And look at the prices. It's sitting at around $400, $500, depending on the size. So this one being pretty fire, I'm pretty sure it's safe to assume is going to sit somewhere around there as well. But that's pretty much it, man. Let me know your thoughts on this box logo. Let me know uh, if you're going to keep it, if you're going to resell it. Let me know what you guys think. Of course, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope you guys took away some valuable information. Um, if you guys are new to the channel once again and you enjoy the content, if you guys want to see more of this type of stuff, go ahead, hit that subscribe button down below. Go ahead and hit that like button down below for your boy as well. But I appreciate you guys, man. Thank you guys so much for watching. Until next time. Peace.